Number 60. Camera flashes charge a capacitor to high voltage by switching the current through an inductor on and off rapidly. In what time must the 0.1 amp current through a 2 milli Henry inductor be switched on or off to induce a 500 volt EMF? So this is a self-inductance uh, problem. So we need the self-inductance formula. This says that the EMF that is produced due to the its own current that is changing within that coil is equal to then negative. We can ignore the negative sign. It's just a, uh, a thing of uh, Lenz's law. Just I'm going to just get rid of it. I think. Um, the, uh, so this is then negative L. That stands for the inductance multiplied by the change in the current flowing through the coil divided by the change in the time. All right. So if we need to now solve this for time, right? We're just going to do a little algebra here. You bring the L on down, so it's divided by L. You bring the I on down. Actually, you know it would be easier. No, this would be a lot easier. Notice, watch, the T is in the denominator. We need that in the numerator, so just bring it on up and across. Bring the EMF on down, and look, boom, 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 boom. There it is, right? So this is just going to be now the inductance, 2 milli Henry. You know we need that in Henry, so minus 3. Multiplied then by the change in the current, so the change in current is going to be 0 0.1 amps. And the induced EMF, they told us, is going to be 500 volts. So, plug and chug. 2 times 10 to the minus 3 times 0 0.1 divided by 500. 4 times 10 to the minus 7th. Okay. So, 4 times 10 to the minus 7th. So, this is 4. Watch your sig figs. I'm not really caring about them, but you know that by now. So this is the seconds, okay? So I guess 0.4 microseconds if you want, whatever units you need. All right, but that's it. Straightforward. Guys, thanks for tuning in. Hope that helps. Check out some more of the videos, and we will see you soon. Take care.